uh, Darren Doherty, who is going to be teaching uh, a course at Ragman's Lane Farm on the 18th of June. It's a four-day course, and uh, I'm just going to be asking him some questions about the course. So, hi, Darren. Hi, Matt. Welcome to London Town. Yes, right near London Bridge. <laughs> We're pretending it's the country. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Doing what we can. This is a holistically managed hedge. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It is very well. And, um, it has a mulch of cigarette butts, which is um, awesome. <laughs> very um, urban. Yeah. So. Um, Better than an, a mulch of vapes. That's true. Yeah, which it may yeah, no, rock down eventually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the course is um, uh, farm planning. Mm -hmm. So, tell tell me exactly what people can expect from from the course. Well, um, it's an interesting one in terms that we've been, as you know, because you've done this journey with us in doing the first Rex program at Cowdery back in 2011. Um, we've sort of evolved and listened to something like over 1,200 people who've done workshops with us now online in the last two years, and and before in that. We wanted to have something that was a bit more of a hybrid that allowed you to have the online experience at the same time as have the on-site experience. People, farmers love to talk to other farmers yeah. and the online experience only goes so far yeah. but yeah. then the on-site experience only goes so far because you're also trying to get support all of the rest of it. A lot of people finish a course and then they want more and they want to know, oh, how can we keep in touch and all of that. So yeah. we sort of package that together. So as soon as someone signs on, then they come on to the Regrarians Workplace, which has got thousands of producers from all over the world. And we put and we give them access to all the webinars and all of that that teach them how to put the maps together and that sort of thing and so on and so forth. And then when they come to the program itself, they're kind of already prepared uh, in, a, in a large part and then we spend the time at the course um, having their farm plans and then working in a, with a maximum number of people of 30 and you will then um, work to develop I suppose concentrate on what the priorities are right now as far as your farm plan is mm -hmm. you know and every farm is going to be different with that yep. um, and then and then have us all work together to, to get the nuts and bolts of what the farm plan is going to look like for say the next five years as opposed to getting so far ahead of yourself where it's inevitable your, your plans will change anyway because things do change yeah and then after that you've still got um, a calendar year of support within the and membership of the Regrarians um, workplace which is where you know again you can connect with producers you know other land if you're a, you know, a, la a fine land producer or a fat land producer you can connect with a number of those, or if you're an Apple producer, yep. and so on. And that's 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 what that's the kind of support that we're offering with this program. So, in terms of the the subject matter that you're mm -hmm. you're going through, you're talking about uh, landscape design. Yeah, well, we've developed our own platform, sure. um, the Regrarians platform. So, um, which is you know starts with climate and then looks at, and and that's the climate between your ears as much as yeah. the climate of how hot and cold it is, yeah. um, but also the uh, looking at your landscape and what it's capable of, yeah. because so much of what we're doing with a farm plan is it, it's a nexus between what you're capable of and what you actually like doing, right. um, and what your landscape's actually capable of doing, and and how can you bring that together, and then what's missing to enable that. Yeah. Um, so that's that's really what. You know, so it's not just about landscape planning, it's also about financial planning, it's also about life planning for yeah. that matter. So yeah. trying to bring those things together. And the sort of people that you would expect to want to come on the course, how, where are you aiming this? Um, well, we're pitching it fair, fairly and squarely to, to farmers, to sure. producers. Um, but that said, um, as we've done with a lot of our programs, there's an emerging number of people who um, are farmer advisors and whatnot, and so, we expect that, that that crowd will come along as well, the advisory crowd. Yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, I think, I think, and this is the noise that we've got already that it'll be mostly producers. Yeah, but yeah. by all means, if you're a if you're a consultant or an advisor, or, yeah. um, or even if you're looking in the future to be a farmer and understand um, what it takes to plan an operation, you sure. know, as it, because it is an enterprise. Yeah. Um, how to be more professional about it? Well, and that's then it's certainly a help for that as okay. well. Yeah. Okay. 
And so there's a mixture of practical and, and theoretical input. On yeah, the yeah. The um, well, the theory. You can't. It, planning is a theoretical yeah. operation. Yeah. Um, um, and the and the practical part of it, I suppose, is where people are getting out and reading landscapes and, and doing them on 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 farm monitoring. Yeah. But uh, once that's done, a lot of it's desktop work, yeah. which is you know in large part why we've gone with the shorter format. And while we've well the shorter on-site format, and why we've allied it with uh, with the, the or hybridised it with the uh, with the online, okay. because then yeah. people can over time go and look at their farm and then respond and, yeah. and work that within the sort of greater community that we've got. Yeah.